Hey guys, so I came back from seeing Shazam. Um, what can I say? Shazam was really good. And, um, gonna have one of these Rackadoolig Wild Berries flavored cider. Comes in there, focuses. Anyway, yeah, Shazam was um, good. I I want to watch it again. It was that good. So, mm. I said I'd have one drink for tomorrow or last night and tonight. So yeah, four point five percent alcohol. Yeah. Um, what I can't say with Shazam is it, um, I'm not going to do any spoilers with this, but, um, it dove really well into foster homes and group homes and, um, um, it was dark in some places. Um, I kind of knew that from the start, but I didn't actually really know that because there are some things that you might want to hold off from your from like little kids seeing it because they probably be like pretty yeah, pretty scared of it but um man and Zachary Levi this this drink has sort of like a different smell of it maybe because it is um a Swedish Swedish um Beverage, yep, Sweden. I might do it like da 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 da. Different, different hero, different hero altogether. You should just call me. We'll we'll do the S for 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 Shazam. Let's say okay. But I don't I don't really have a lot of time. I have about six minutes to just kind of go on about what I thought of Shazam. Damn, gotta say it nasally. Gonna go yam. Shazam. But, man, how do I talk about it without spoiling anything? It's, um, um, quite a dark movie, too, and, uh, quite a bucket full of fun, too. Um, I hope it gets a sequel as soon as possible. Um, I think for me, watchability, like to rewatch it again. Compared to that and um, Marvel's Captain Marvel, which they stole from Shazam, who originally was called Captain Marvel, I think I would choose Shazam. Um, for me, I mean, for me, Captain Marvel was really good because of Agent Coulson, played by I don't know who it is, the actor's name, and Samuel Jackson was the highlight and the cat as well too. Um, this movie, like Zachary Levi, he knows how to play as like a, a boy trapped in a man's body with those powers. And some of the things in there that just was just freaking, actually, I will say it, fucking hilarious. They were, it was, it was so worth it. So I'd love to see it again. I'd love to see it again. Um, go see it. If you want to go see it. Um, but it was good. It was really, it was marvelous. Um, I could, I can relate to some of the stuff because of the, uh, well, if, if, if you know anything about Shazam or the origins or even just, just read it up because I was looking at a, a bookstore today and looking at some really cool comic books. I didn't get any comic comic books, but I'd like, you know, it's so good that I really want to, I really want to read comic books. And I'm not much of a comic book reader, but I really want to start doing that. And I'd, I'd give it, I'd give it a solid A. 
Um, not an A plus, but I give it. I give it an A. I don't think any movie is picture perfect, but man, was that movie ever good! Right, I'm gonna take my time drinking this. Thought I'd give, say that I just came back from Cap seeing, well, DC's Captain Marvel Shazam, and it was, it was good. Um, I think I knew it was gonna be good, but I didn't know it was gonna be this good like you know I've got a smile going on here I don't normally smile just like the Joker thing it's just like trying to smile even though that some people just can't makes them uncomfortable but it was damn good uh, go see it I can't really talk much about it unless going into spoiler territory go see the movie check it out Mark Strong is in it plays the villain and Zachary Levi Zachary Levi plays Shazam and Astro Angel plays Billy Batson. It's a really cool movie. Go check it out. Until next time.